What is up all my dorks, nerds, geeks, and gamers? It's your host Ghost here, and today we're going to be checking out all the awesome stuff that dropped at DC Fandom over the weekend. Uh, starting off with Gotham Knights, let's hop right into the original announcement trailer now, and then we'll do another video of the gameplay trailer they also dropped. So let's hop right into the announcement trailer here, see what we can see, and then let's talk about it. Here we go. Alright, press and play. What do we got? What do we got for New Age Batman? In breaking news, we've received reports of an explosion somewhere north of the We're city. Still explosion? For the to confirm if there the end of Arkham Knight, I assume. The story is evolving rapidly. Please bear with us. We heard this really loud boom. There was smoke everywhere. But I've also heard this is not connected to Arkham Knight, so it's kind of like a soft reboot, I guess you can kind of say. Where it kind of carries stuff over, but it's a different version of that stuff. An explosion rocked Gotham City earlier today. We are now able to confirm that billionaire philanthropist Bruce Wayne is... Bruce Wayne is missing, or dead, or gone. We don't know. I have a feeling that's going to be a big uh, plot point in the, tr in the actual game itself. Code Black. There he is, there's our boy. If you're watching this, he's dead. dead. Jason Todd, back. it looks like. That's a different Jason Todd. So yeah, it is it's a soft reboot. This message was automatically triggered Oracle. when I destroyed the cave and everything it contained. We both know it won't take long for Gotham's criminals to realize nice. that Batman is gone. And you can't count man, these the graphics look great, though. Man, I'm a trusted I know it's a uh, scripted trailer, but it looks Gotham good. It looks really good. More than ever. Nightwing, Unlimited Robin, Batgirl, Red Hood. Some of the technology is outdated. Robin looking like uh, Tom Holland over here. All of my files. You've always had my back when I needed you. I know you'll keep Gotham safe. Good luck. Yeah, that's a good premise. I can get down with that. Batman's gone. Somebody's got to save Gotham. Who's left? Well, the Bat family. I'm liking this. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're going to have co-op. Oh, we better have co-op. Uh, we have, have to have co-op. At least two people. Four people would be amazing, but I don't see that happening. Robin. Oh, I like that. I like the little symbols behind them when they jump down. Okay, so... It looks like it's going to be smooth. I'm not sure what the actual combat system is yet. Um, but it looks very Arkham-esque. Nightwing. One of my faves. Looking good. Nice. Now, Red Hood. This is who I'm going to be playing as for the most part. Boom, boom. Nice. Finishing move, it looks like. Alright. From crime fighters to vigilantes. Robin's got his invisibility move. Cool. Looks like a finisher there. <clears throat> From vigilantes to heroes. Bad girl's always fun. She was really fun in uh, Arkham Knight. Red Hood's got a teleport. Team attacks, so there you go, two player it looks like. Uh, Riddler, some sort of Riddler trap it looks like. From heroes. Okay, we got the bikes, cool. Mr. Freeze, very awesome. Tonight's, okay. Alright, I'm down. Gotham Knights. Made by WB Montreal. See, that looks like Bruce every time I'm... No one talks about them. Court of Owls. Okay. Yeah, that's awesome. See, I think that could be Bruce, though. I think Bruce is going to play into the Court of Owls story. Word is said. Ooh, but it's chilling, man. It looks so good. One of the best storylines from Batman in, in new recent ages, at least. The town oh man. Height. Step into the night. 2021. Is it PS4, Xbox One, PS5? Doesn't say.
All right, so that was the trailer, guys. Let's uh, talk about it. So that was Gotham Knights. Uh, you got to see all four members of the Bat Family. Um, it was announced. We got to see we're going to be able to play as those four characters. I don't know if it's two-player, if it's four-player, if it even plays like Arkham Knight. We didn't get to see any of that in the trailer. But from what we did get to see, um, I'm pretty hyped for. Um, I think they can build off of what they've set, the story they've set themselves up for. I think they can build on and I think they can achieve a good um, Batman game because we know WB Montreal can do it. Um, and can they do a game without Batman? That's why I'm kind of iffy. I think uh, I think Batman will play a role in the story somewhere. If that's with the Talon or with another group or somewhere else on the line, I definitely see Batman and Bruce Wayne still playing a role in this universe. Um, so yeah, I'm hyped for it. That's my thoughts on it. I really want to play it. I think it's going to be an awesome game. Um, I wish they did follow the continuity of Arkham uh, Knight and the Arkham Universe a little bit better, but it's if they went off their own direction, that's cool. So that means we're going to see a whole new Gotham, a whole new take on the villains. So that has me hyped up, guys. Stay tuned for the gameplay uh, reveal trailer. We're going to be doing that next. So I will get to see finally how it plays and how, it, how it's actually going to be. So stay tuned for that. Like, subscribe, or share, and keep it right here on Dorkston. I've been your host, Ghost Guys. Adios. Adios.